¿Qué tal, curiosillos? Hace ya algún tiempo que no hacemos ningún dictado, así que hoy vamos a hacer un pequeño dictado de un texto de aproximadamente 140 palabras. Ya sabéis que no son textos muy extensos, pero eso sí, vamos a ir a un ritmo un pelín más ligero que otras veces, porque se supone que estamos practicando con los dictados anteriores y que ya tenemos que ir cogiendo un poquito más de ritmo. Así que, bueno, si estás listo, ya lo sabes. Ponte las pilas, coge lápiz y papel, que empezamos a dictar, pero ya mismo. Comenzamos ya nuestro dictado de hoy. Recuerda que cuando finalices el dictado viene la corrección, así que no pares el vídeo porque tienes que ver si has cometido muchos errores y después dejármelo en los comentarios para saber yo qué tal te ha ido. Venga, pues vamos allá. Ready, steady, go. Last month, coma, I decided to start exercising to get in shape and to improve my health. Stop. Repito esta frase. Last month, coma, I decided to start exercising to get in shape and to improve my health. Stop. When I was younger, coma, I used to go dancing from time to time. Coma. But I didn't use to go to the gym. Stop. I repeat this last sentence. When I was younger, coma, I used to go dancing from time to time, coma, but I didn't use to go to the gym. Stop. When the weather is nice, coma, especially In spring and summer, coma, I prefer to exercise outside. Stop. When the weather is nice, coma, especially in spring and summer, I prefer to exercise outside. Stop. I love running around the lake that is in the park next to My house. Stop. Repito esta última. I love running around the lake that is in the park next to my house. Stop. Continuamos. I often attend yoga classes, coma, which are great 
to improve my flexibility. Stop. I repeat. I often attend yoga classes, coma, which are great to improve my flexibility. Stop. We continue. Riding the bike is also one of my favorite activities because it allows me to enjoy the countryside. Stop. I repeat. Riding the bike is also one of my favorite activities because it allows me to enjoy the countryside. Stop. Seguimos. I go to the gym twice a week. Stop. I go to the gym twice a week. Stop. I want to reach my fitness goals so that I feel better and have more energy. Stop. Repito esto último. I go to the gym twice a week. Stop. I want to reach my fitness goals so that I feel better and have more energy. Stop. Some days I find it difficult to get the time to exercise. Coma. But at last I always manage to find it. Stop. Repito esto último. Some days I find it difficult to get the time to exercise coma. But at last I always manage to find it. Y se acabó. Este ha sido el dictado de hoy. ¿Ha sido muy rápido? No, ¿verdad? Ha ido bien la cosa. Bueno, pues antes de pasar a ver los errores que has tenido, que te los muestro a continuación. Bueno, los errores no te los muestro. Te muestro la solución del dictado. Acuérdate de suscribirte. Venga, vamos a ver el texto. ¿Cómo había que escribirlo? Vamos a comprobar qué tal se te ha dado este dictado. Este es el texto que acabas de escribir. Veamos qué tal ha ido. Last month, I decided to start exercising to get in shape and to improve my health. When I was younger, I used to go dancing from time to time, but I didn't use to go to the gym. 
when the weather is nice, especially in spring and summer, I prefer to exercise outside. I love running around the lake that is in the park next to my house. I often attend yoga classes, which are great to improve my flexibility. Riding the bike is also one of my favorite activities because it allows me to enjoy the countryside. I go to the gym twice a week. I want to reach my fitness goals so that I feel better and have more energy. Some days I find it difficult to get the time to exercise. But at last I always manage to find it.